if you're using Tailwind, Panda CSS, StyleX, any of these Atomic CSS libraries, you're going to want this Chrome extension. So the problem that we have in Atomic CSS is you're applying classes to your elements for every single property that you want. And that can get quite long when you're trying to look at the Chrome dev tools and trying to debug things, right? So if you've got 15 classes on an element, you're kind of scrolling forever. One little tip you can do is you can click on this .cls thing and you can toggle those classes on and off to see what you're working with. But if you want to get into actually modifying those values, it's a little bit trickier. So Alexander Stommer from the Panda project comes up with this Chrome extension called Atomic CSS. And it basically does what I want. Um, I tweeted about this, I don't know, six months ago. And he's like, oh yeah, I want that too. And he built it. Uh, he has taken all of the properties. You can see what the class is um, being applied here. And then it will also tell you what's, what is actually being applied to the element. You can, of course, toggle them on and off as well as change the values that are in there. Some other cool things where you can also show the layers if you're using new CSS layering. So here it shows me this is base. This is utilities. I like this a lot because often I don't care about the base reset and I just want to see what's in my other CSS layers. We'll also give you the ability to group it by media queries and you can toggle hiding the, the selectors. I like that quite a bit. So, so go grab it for our, your browser. It's called Atomic CSS DevTools. I honestly wish that Chrome would just add this type of feature right to DevTools and a little birdie told me they're going to redesign that. But for now, this works really well and I'm stoked about it. That's the end of the video. However, you know what we should do right now? Let's have a massive fight in the comments about whether Tailwind Panda is a good way to write CSS or not. Make sure you, you attack people and their skill set of, of being able to write CSS, all of that good stuff. See you in the comments.